Greetings, I'm Epictetus, and this is... I did it again. Greetings, wow. I'm Epictetus. And I'm Cosmic Chimp, and together we are... Cosmically Epic, because this yeah, isn't myself all by myself. It's me and Cosmic. It's Cosmic and I. It's wait, the wait, wait. two of is us. Is it myself, myself, and myself? It's... I'm sure that's, like, that's you all over. No, it's... I'm not. I'm not like that maybe a little sometimes but not all the time i'm sorry i'm sorry but today we're going down to the planet right yes we are we, we are moving down to that planet and we're taking this lovely ship of ours i'll let you run around the ship and do the things or do you want to uh, actually do the flying no no i'll run around and do the things i should walk okay. what, what things do we need done yeah. I Let's need find to out. See it. All right, parking brake released, and then I, I did it too early. I need to. Okay. All right. We are released <laughs> from the station. Think of a set. Oh, yeah, I sat in the toilet in the back, and I could see things. <laughs> oh, you get the external view. <laughs> yep. Just like in the real world. Well, there's nothing like going to the going to the bog and having something nice to watch. Or read. So a second ago there was a signal down on the planet. And then there wasn't. So I'm heading toward that signal in hopes that we end up near that signal. Okay. I'm not sure if that'll happen or not. But we are running at full speed straight toward the planet. How's it going? Not bad. Um, I think I might build a button just for the gravity. Just because I'm bored. <laughs> just because you're bored. Oh, you know what? Hang on. I want to double check. Uh, the parachute hatch is set for... Auto-deploy auto -deploy at 300 meters. Eh, what do you say? 500 meters? Let's do 500 meters. That seems reasonable, right? Yep. I'm okay, okay. with that. Alright, good. So, yeah, I should probably go and check. Oh, we have planet gravity. Do oh, we? and we're rotating so much we were no longer pointed where we were going. Alright, I'll turn the gravity off. Uh, yeah. It's gonna be a little low. Like, we're at point one. I think this is the right direction. Oh. Oh, I feel it now. What? The... The gravity, the, the minute it comes off. Oh, the rotation? Or the... Or the fact yeah, the that rotation. we don't have gravity? Yeah, the fact that we don't have gravity and I'm like... Sliding down to my doom. <laughs> I'm fine. Man, I wish I knew where that signal was. Oh, uh, we don't have an antenna on this ship. Of any kind. Nope. Oh, man. I shouldn't have turned the gravity off. <laughs> well, we were at 0.2 planet gravity. Oh, but we're not pointing. That's the problem. Here, Cosmic, let me try it. Let me help you out. Oh, thank you. Right, now you can point down. Oops. <laughs> Hang on. I'm going to a seat. All right, we are 8,000 meters. All right, I'm in a seat. Okay. Are we already smoking already at the front? Oh, uh, no, that's that's actually the uh, the atmosphere. There's a little bit of atmosphere, that and it's cool. sucking it in to fill our oxygen tanks. Nice. Yeah. Ah. Uh, okay. Are, are the... Are the um, Parachutes going anytime, anytime soon? Are the what? Parachutes, maybe anytime soon? Oh no no no, we're at, we're still maybe, five thousand meters. Up. We don't want to. We don't want them People going off. People, planet below us. Big. We're gonna crash land. Help! <laughs> help! You said you're in a seat. I hope. <laughs> I'm in a seat. I'm on. I'm. Do you know what? Funnily enough, I'm on the toilet. You know. <laughs> of course you are. Just in case we hit the ground. You'll be fine. I've got a place to. You know, relieve yourself. <laughs> pat my chance. There you go. 
Well, we're plummeting to our doom. Oh, hey, Cosmic. Uh, Ooh. no, it's fine. Never mind. It's all good. Okay, Cosmic, we are at 1,500 meters. If the uh -huh. if this parachute doesn't release at um, at 500, I'm turning on the dampeners. Oh no! Or sorry, 400, 400. Oh look, parachute. Oh, nice. <laughs> ah, nice. Ah, oh, that was very cool. Okay, I have faith in them again. The faith is real. Okay. Now the only problem is. Are we landing? Here we go. Dampeners are on. Parachute is released. Oh, wow. Look, we can just hover. Nice. Now, if you land, or actually, wait, 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 and wait, I wait. hold an antenna. Is it just me, or is there... Oh, shoot. The parachute just went again. Can you disable the parachute hatch, please? Uh, guess what? There's a signal one, one kilometer in front of us. And I'm heading straight Ooh. toward it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one we're meant to go to. Oh, is that's it? perfect. I think yep. is this is the one that you can control the little buggy from. Yep. Nice. So this actually has a uh, ray. Oh shoot! What was that smoke? What was what smoke? I don't know. Some smoke came out of our left engine. I don't see anything. Well, it's not here there anymore, but it was like it's not suddenly. It's a landing pad. There is a landing pad. I don't know if I can land on it. Let's see. Oh I, oh, I see the smoke now. Why, why am I having trouble staying up? Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm going to land it right here. Hey, I got the ramp down, right? Okay. Uh, okay, the thrusters nope. at the back seem fine. Yeah, the thrusters are fine. So yeah. Where was the damage from? I don't know. It's weird. Actually, is there anything... In the control panel that says there's damage. That's what I was just thinking. I'm gonna. I got a control panel here, and not seeing anything red. We must. Maybe. Maybe it was just a, a bug. I don't know. Well, or sometimes you can do damage without doing damage. Like like it's kind of almost like a warning for imminent damage. Maybe it was something like that. One way or another, we're on the ground safely and cosmic. We've got a yes. buggy. Yes, we do. I'm going to get rid of some stuff. Okay. On my body. You want to do me a huge favor? Uh-huh. Would you like to uh Would you like to hit the the mag magneto and let me go? Where's the magnet button? This one right it's, here? It's yeah, it's it's the third one down or the second one down? There we go. Nice. Parking brake off. And Beautiful. Ooh, look at these. Oh, very well done. These containers look like proper shipping containers. Oh, yeah? Let me see. Very nicely done. Oh, neat. Is there anything in them? Ooh, some oh, iron. Well, some there's iron in I there. And... Oh, okay. And there's some parts in that one. I don't think this is the one that we were looking at. No, 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 this is the one that connects to the buggy. Is it? Yeah, because the buggy is actually down there. We parked right next to the buggy. Oh. The little drone thing. Sorry, not the buggy, the drone. Oh, look, this survival kit's offline. Oh, <laughs> you better turn it on. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, there's one on the ship, too, so it should be okay. Oh, this is cool. Two little beds. Okay, so this seems pretty... It's pretty forward, basic, simple. but it's nice. Mm -hmm. So you were driving this thing around, this this little this little guy right here. Ah. You were driving this little guy around from up on the station, way yep. up there. Yeah, I've never. I never. You can't see yourself. You can only see out the no. camera. Where is the camera? Camera's at the front here. Oh, that's the front. Oh, there we go. Okay, so there's a camera, and then there's. Um, uranium in it. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> All right, turn it turn it around like like 180. Or, or do you want me to have the the rear end facing? Yeah, yeah, I want the rear end facing me. Just okay. keep going, keep going, keep going. There you go. So lower that down. Try and keep it as level as possible. And 
Wow, it's hard to see through the dust that's getting kicked up. That's great. And bark. Hit P. Yeah. Isn't that P lovely? Yes, it is. That is perfect. We need okay. to decide where we're going to make our home. Like, are we going to build onto this thing? Are we going to build something new? What, what are we going to do? And these two grids do not appear to be connected. This one that I'm on mm. and that one up there. So we can connect these two together. Uh, and then we could continue. We could build a third building and connect all of them together. We got lots of options here. What about, what about this epic? What? Over this way. There's a nice little desert area. Uh huh. We could probably start here, start our own wee thing going, and then. Oh, just build from completely there. from scratch down there? Yeah. I'm okay with that. The buggy has an ore detector on it, so let's see. Nice. Uh, so this is silicon. And. Oh, ore. wait, have we just found Silicon Valley? <laughs> Welcome to Silicon Valley, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, I like it. I heard that cosmic big. Bang. I heard nothing. I know mm -hmm. nothing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's this? Cobalt and coo cobalt. That's nice. That's something you can't get out of just mining rock. So what do you say? Did I, did I, did I tell you that I, this was my idea? I... It was a great idea. <laughs> I didn't say it was a bad idea. What if we? Uh, okay. What if we build right here? Like right over the cobalt. We make a big oh, mining wait. operation underneath it. Does this mean it's the cobalt club point too? Oh, <laughs> no, it's Sil <laughs> is the cobalt club in Silicon Valley now? I didn't know. It will be. Yep. <laughs> wow, silicon, cobalt, and nickel all in this one spot. Nah, you are really okay. close to the ground. You are just freak Yep, yep, yep. It's come to a screeching halt. <laughs> I saw like chunks and stuff. I wonder if you did any damage. Nope. No damage. No, you still didn't Everything. do any damage. Boy, Space Engineers has come a long way, hasn't it? <laughs> Remember when okay. shapes ships were made of paper? Six percent damage. Six percent? On one. Oh, yep. Four percent. Five percent now. <laughs> That's excellent. We just need some interior plate. Cosmic. Yo. Those are 25 steel plates each. Mm -hmm. Want to see something cool? Okay. That is five. Yes. And from the top, it looks just the same. Can't even finish that one. Okay. I mean, not exactly the same, but it looks very similar. Okay, I can do that. Actually, do you know what I want to do? Those and the uh, don't date that one down yet. Uh, Not where are to. they? Yes, so you, and we can mix them Those. up too. I, and because I kind of want it to look like it's been assembled from whatever was found around, like somebody took apart things and whatnot. What are these beam blocks? These are twenty-five as well. But <laughs> for right now, just I'm just saying initially. I'm just doing the outer. I'm not doing the whole. Okay. I'm going to start working on things like wind turbines. We decide five is about right, I think. You can always change it later. There we go. Short a few steel plates, but that's okay. Uh, okay. We are now generating power. Where do we, we, I want to stick the, the car, large cargo container underneath the ground. Just kind of sticking out, but in, uh, in so let's not do large cargo containers for right now. Let's just do mediums because I honestly I don't think we need larges. Like not medium, sure? but a small. Um, for the initial, just for now. I, I know you want to go cosmic all over this thing, but I'm not wanting to go cosmic. I just. But the smalls will hold. Okay, so let's. Let me let me take a look at something really quick large cargo container we are using one fifth of a large cargo container right now okay a small i believe is one ninth so we would need two smalls to contain everything we have but once we actually start putting all this stuff down we're gonna 
we're not going to need nearly as much storage space either. So you, you see what I mean? Yeah, I know, but and then we'll, like, we'll eventually the large we will industrial absolutely... one looks awesome. Oh yeah, well, and we'll absolutely have one eventually. But right now we don't have a ton of stuff to work with. And if you use all of our parts to make a card container that's five times what we need. You, you see what I'm saying? No, I, I see what you're saying, and I, I get what you're putting down. Okay. It just it stinks. That's all. <laughs> we can just go to creative mode if you want. Just... No, 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 no. Wish yourself. Is it working? I think so. I have some more ores for it. Yeah. Make silicon. Ooh, is that gold? Silver. Did you just throw silver in there? Yep, from the ship. Nice. Very cool. I I went up to the uh, to the abandoned outpost out there up there, and yeah. I grabbed a bunch of stuff that they had laying around. Okay, so we have Sweet. these two up and running now. One thing, as I noticed, yep. well, I might want to change the assembler over to the right hand side. Why is that? I don't know, I just, I don't like the fact that you can't, like, walk into it, and then you're going to have... Oh, you want to be able to walk into this little yeah. place right here that has no purpose? Exactly. I mean, it, it has no purpose. <laughs> Why have it, though? That, that's annoying me. I, I, I don't know. But one way or another, or at least have a variation with. Uh, yeah, okay. They didn't work. even add a control panel. I don't understand why. Doesn't it seem like there should be a control panel there? Yep. The assembler or the refinery, I mean, has a control panel up on the top, which is nice. But yeah, it's not perfect, but I like it. I hate the corner lights initially. I know why they make them so lame, but they're just really low, like two meter radius. Come on, let's go for 10 meter. I like to drop the intensity a little bit. That should be good. See, doesn't that look so much nicer? It does. I like this. I like to put a, light, a little uh, yellow to it. It gives it like a warmth glow. Yeah, yeah, we could do that. But, no, that's fine. No, yeah, no, no. Let's I, like, go. I like the idea. Or it's kind of a, let's see, if I pull out some, uh, yeah, if I pull out some blue, no. If I pull out some red, no. How do you, how do you make, how do you make yellow? <laughs> go to yellow. There we go. I pull out some blue to make a little yellow. Yeah, see, that looks a lot better. Yeah, that looks pretty Much good. Much better. Oh, I ran out of uh, oxygen fast. Oh, sandstorm. Oh. I forgot about sandstorms, and that is why we build ourselves in a, in a building. Yeah, okay, sandstorm. Um, yeah, we're definitely going to want mm -hmm. walls on this eventually, but mm -hmm. we don't need it event immediately. Also, good thing about sandstorms? Wow. What is it? <laughs> so, our max output for the wind turbine is, like, shooting off. <laughs> the battery we b will be fully charged in negative 281 days. Look at the wind turbine's output. Now that battery is going to be fully recharged in two hours. Nice. Don't know that those are going to be optimal for very long. That's closer than I thought they were. Oh well. Cosmic, what is your plan? I've got loads of plans, but the thing is, it's hard to airtight this because of the big refinery and yeah it's going to be hard so airtighting around this you'd have to wrap the refinery and you know, i understand we don't need yeah. to have air tightness when the fact that we have oxygen on the planet but yeah but when those sandstorms come us, <laughs> especially when we log off and stuff like that we need to we want to be safe yeah so I, i'm thinking if I half what I've done here, take all this down and just kind of make a offset shelter. So like have what, all this outside, all out, like open. So ends. like build like walls down 
like this isn't like a permanent wall i'm just kind of laying it out but like yeah, build a wall something like, like that yeah like that oh huh. the, uh, i would even put the wall closer in give us more space to build well you have to move your door if we put the wall like there we can then we can still access these cargo containers indoors you know what i mean okay yeah so like have the door there then oh yeah let me take these out yeah, yeah, yeah. And then so the the refinery itself will be outdoors. Yep. But the cargo containers will be indoors so that we can access all the controls. And you can still access from outside into everything. Yeah, I like that. Very nice. Very nice? Very nice. All right, I'm going like to go it. fly the ship over. Is it just me or is there another windstorm coming? There's another one. Nice. Perfect perfect environment to go and try and dock a ship in. Did, did nobody tell you that was the best way to do it? it? To always try and dock a ship in a windstorm? Yep. Well, it's good for our batteries. That's what I always say. Fully recharged <laughs> in two hours. Say that? <laughs> yeah, that's what I always say. <laughs> you know, did you... Okay, did your parents ever say, like, when it was raining, it's, it's good for the flowers? No. It, really? Like when kids All complain, they said to me was, you're waterproof on your goal. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. My, my parents were always like, it's, it's good for the flowers. If it didn't rain, then the flowers wouldn't grow. And I was always like, I don't care about the flowers. I want to go out and play. <laughs> now I have a camera. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's really, uh, it's really winding. This is this is this is fun, Cosmic. What do you think? Yeah, I'm loving it. It's great. Should I actually try and now that I have a camera, I actually would feel better about trying to connect. I this. mean, I could try and help you, but I mean, no, no, I'm gonna have to do this on my own. But the camera will help. Actually, you know, there is something you can do. What's that? You could uh, raise the. Oops. You could raise the uh, the conveyor, the connector. Raise it. How far? Uh, 1.5 meter. I think that's right. Am I locked in? Yeah, you you're locked. Nice. Okay. Can you, uh, oh, jeez. Oh, my lord. I can't see anything. Yeah, me either. Okay, first of all, am I going to break this if I turn off the thrusters? I think I am. First of all, I need to get some okay. uh, power. I'm going to... <laughs> I'm gonna find out. I think I'm gonna break go, this go, if go, I go. turn off the thrusters. Give me two seconds. All right. You gonna lower me down? I think that's gonna work. What? Lowering? Gonna lower me down? What are you talking about? Yeah. What's what? Lowering what's the piston work? down. Okay. Go ahead. Lower it down. I like that. I like that. I think that'd be pretty cool. Just bringing you down to the surface. Okay. You can stop it. That is. Oops. There we go. There we go. Now I'm gonna kill the thrusters. And I think. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's that's nice and smooth. If we right. have that on a button panel, that'd be awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Okay. I want a better welder. Hey, perfect timing, cosmic. <laughs> I know. It's, so it's almost done, and yeah, it's a bright and beautiful day. What's what's underneath the med bay? What's underneath the med bay? Another conveyor junction. Like that. So that'll hook up into the med bay, and then if we want, we can do a vent. Like, I was thinking we can connect a vent maybe off the side, like here, but. Hmm. Can we not go above it, actually? Oh, and have a vent coming in from the top? We'd have to, like, put a little bump on the top somewhere. Well, if I take all that section off, we can also run the piping along the top as well. That's true. You'd have to, so the whole thing would have to go up a floor. Hmm, this is fun. I want a better drill sooner than later. <laughs> Do we want the elite ones? <laughs> yeah. 
Okay, that should get us enough nickel, I think. Pretty soon. Okay. Yeah, I've got energy. That's fine, coming back. Good. I think I actually have enough nickel for medical components. Where are the, where are the medical? Where are the medical? Where? Where? Yes. Yes. Medical components. Guess what we have, Cosmic? We have a medical bay. Uh -huh. Nice. So, the second floor is going Wait. to be above us, obviously. Oh. Okay. Yeah, sure. But to get up here, you have to come up the stairs here. Okay. Uh, I was thinking about putting a wee window there anyway to look down, or maybe like a balcony. I don't know. I'm, I'm still working that out. Now, what are we going to stick up here on this floor? I don't know. We're going to stick a... What's it called? I, that thing that gives you air. <laughs> a vent. A vent. Oh, yeah. Actually, if we want, we could put a we could put an oxygen tank up here and a vent that pulls in. Mm -hmm. And then we would always have air inside without using ice. The thing is, does this need to be enclosed? This could be open. Nice. We're good. What? This could be opened as well. It doesn't have to be enclosed. How do you figure? If we want, if we want the inside to be pressurized, what we do is we put the vent underneath the oxygen tank up here, facing down, and yeah. then close this side. Yep. I don't. I don't know what you're talking about, but yeah, sounds good. Let's see, what else do we need? We need uh, motors. Oh, motors are going to be a problem. No, they're not. Look at how many motors we have. We have ridiculous amounts of motors. Cosmic, you don't even have to worry about motors. We've got plenty. So stop it. Thank you. Yeah, I'll stop it right now. <laughs> okay. Wow. I don't know what you were like. You were all concerned that we weren't going to have enough motors. I'm like, we got plenty of motors. Well, see, that's the thing. You're right. When I'm right, I'm right. You know what, Cause? I don't know why I just called you Cause again. This is a new habit of mine. I'm realizing something. Why is it? This air, this air thing. Look, can I can I do one thing? Yeah. Right. Okay, I'm gonna remove this pipe right here. Like that. Mm -hmm. And then we can put the we can put the vent on this side and have it depressurize into this tank and then the pipe will pressurize the inside. So that is just gonna be So it's a complete closed system. Can't fly. It's a complete closed system so that like yeah. Only I like that. Yeah. I like that better. I was too busy trying to focus of connecting it in, but you're right. Yeah. You're right, you're right. Yeah, I am. I'm not even sure we really need the tank. Oh, I want to try it without the tank first. You sure? Yeah, just for fun. But I'm going to leave your little funky design. <laughs> See that there? You should have it like facing up. No, actually, leave it there. No. Ooh, you know what we should do? Yeah, hang on. What if we do this? What if, what if I put in a conveyor junction like that, and then we put a, a vent on the outside... And then, if we need the tank, we'll stick it on top of that. Okay. Doesn't that sound cool? Yeah. I'm yeah. okay with that. You okay with that? Good. Vent, exterior, depressurize on, and then the other one is going to be called vent interior, for obvious reasons. Depressurize off. And then, that should, once we can make this solid, that should, we won't have low oxygen anymore in here. And it should be just all like free oxygen. Okay, I'm closing the doors. I want to see if, uh, I want to see if this is sealed. Ooh. I hear it. Room pressure, 100%. Yeah, we have high oxygen in here, Cosmic. <laughs> yes. Open that up. <laughs> yep, you see all of it blow out, and now we're at low oxygen. So we don't even need okay. the oxygen tank, because this will just suck it in from the outside. The thing is, it. will will there be oxygen during the sandstorm? 
I think there's still um, low oxygen, but it's even lower. It's like uh, down well, to like... Well, this is the test we'll have to oh. figure out because I'm worried that if we do, for some reason, just for sake that we ran out of oxygen, we had no oxygen and no ice, will that affect this room? I, 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 I want I a little bit of redundancy. We'll find out. We'll, we'll find out. We'll just, we can put, like, I'm going to take my oxygen um, tank my like oxygen bottle and i'm gonna put it in this um wardrobe thing i'm, I'm, I'm gonna do the same <laughs> i like the little porch at the front oh yeah oh yeah we could actually even have some fun with that i like that cosmic you did a fantastic job oh I... look at the rover tracks oh whoa that's actually Wow, it keeps those for a long time. Because that's what I did. I came... How far back does that go? Wow, that's like both trips. So yeah, because I came out here twice. And I think that's two trips. Oh, uh, maybe... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, two trips over here. And then I backed in <laughs> one time. The other time I just stopped and then... Wow. This is that's really good. cool. I like it. I, I like I'm it. impressed with that. And all my footprints all over the place. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you next time on Epic Tech. And as always, stay safe. First base ever without drilling into the ground. I'm <laughs> loving it so far. Yeah. <laughs> this looks really good. We definitely need to vary up the texture a little bit.